Here we go, we're moving along. Things are looking pretty good. And Vin Diesel, guide my nitrous. Hello everybody, Grace Two Plays, and we're back with more My Summer Nitrous. That's right. The nitrous is here. Topless Gun has decided that the Finnish countryside is not littered enough with the bodies of the unprepared. So he has added nitrous to the game. Why? I guess the real answer is, why not? But, a little bit thirsty here. I'm already like three beers in for the day. Oh, I thought I was gonna go into the sink. I'm already like three beers into the day. It's, what time is it? Two? Huh, it feels later than that. I don't know why, but I guess it's quite a nice day. We can always check to see what the weather's like outside by smashing our head through the wall finish headbutt style. Plenty of sausage in the refrigerator for all times of the day. Over here. Oh, and I, and in a little minute, I'm gonna show you guys something that you can be so proud of me. Over here, the magazine of death that will bring to us our absolute destruction. And with it, oh, where is it? Where is it? Not there. There it is. The Ilokasu Asenu Sarya. Yeah, that sounds appropriate. Anyway, 5,100 marks, but we're going to be just fine because, first let me grab this envelope over here. Because, hold on, wait for it, wait for it. Our suitcase is back. I put it over here in the fireplace so I wouldn't misplace it again. And... Look at this bull crap. Not only do we have a brand new skin for a bit here, we also have, I know it took me, I don't even know how long it's been. It's been since it was implemented in the game. I finally put the lengthened springs in forever. People were like, Gray, for the love of God, put the freaking springs in and you won't have such a problem losing your muffler. Well, guess what? I lost the muffler. That happened, I think a while ago off camera and I haven't found it since then. Oh, also, I found out what was wrong with all my freaking fluids. Someone was like, your head gasket's damaged. It was worse than that. For some reason, my head gasket wasn't even bolted on. Uh, correctly, I should say. Uh, I don't know when that happened. Probably from flipping the car 800 times down the road in any episode of My Summer Car. And one of my hoses wasn't on all the way. Uh, that was probably also from smashing into people. So I was losing all my coolant. So now... We have oil, we have coolant, I adjusted the crap out of this carburetor, so it should be absolutely perfect. Just setting the car up, you boys know how it is. I think that from various spins and such, we've lost all the beer inside of the car. And I'm not gonna sit here and put like 10 cases in, but we at least need a couple of cases of beer over here. I topped off all the fluids again, including the brake fluid, I know. you It's not like we use the brakes anyway, but I feel like we're gonna need it. And I did something, someone was saying, Put slicks on the front and the rally tires on the back. That's interesting. Uh, I'm decided to give that a shot. We'll see if it does anything. Supposedly it's a little bit faster on the road and on the track. Also, I've got the mixture setting right around 13.1, which supposedly is the best mixture setting for the uh, speed and power and torque and all that. Very excited about the nitrous. Very excited about it. Oh, I can't wait. It's gonna be so good. Someone was like, Gray, you're gonna have to ask Spears how to use the nitrous. Oh, the car's so loud, I need to find my muffler. Me and Spears talk every once in a while. I know a bunch of you guys are like, you guys need to play something together. We talk every once in a while on Twitter about boring YouTube stuff. You know all the back end stuff on YouTube? It's hard because a lot of people don't really, don't really know what goes into all this crap. And it gets, it actually gets a little bit lonely slaving away at YouTube, so it's nice every once in a while to get to talk to someone, but I don't need to know how nitrous works. I just need to know how to install it. That's all that really matters. I, I learned things in my summer car by blowing my vehicle up over and over and over again, and damn it, I'm not gonna stop that tried and true method now. But yeah, Spear's a great guy, that velvety voiced bastard. I feel like I lost my muffler around here most recently. Like I said, I'm pretty sure it happened off camera. I was just kind of tooling around going over to Periyarvi and I ended up doing a barrel roll, which is very common by the way. I mean, that's pretty much that's the way it goes. And uh, the muffler went just catapulting. It, the muffler came off so far, like I saw it for just a split second and then it was gone. It was out of my line of sight and I, I scoured the area and I couldn't find it. I'm sure someone's already found it. They're like, at 5.21 in the video, 
And if you do that, that's actually totally fine. I probably won't pick it up for another 30 episodes, but definitely feel free to tell me. But yeah, nitrous, nitrous. We're gonna be just fine. Now, I love the springs because when I would have went across that little that little exit area with the other springs on, it would have ripped both the wheels off. I've had that happen multiple times. But yeah, nitrous, you know, it's one of those things, man. The people that have been around for a while totally know. I am not a car guy that games. I am a gaming guy that sometimes plays games that happen to have cars in them. All it is, is a coincidence, that's it. It just so happened that a game that I love happened to be a game with a lot of vehicles. And that's fine. To me, my summer car is less a car game and more a survival game. Look at this puppy go, oh look who it is. It's whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, holy crap. Also, did he have a new spoiler on the back? It almost looked like he had a new spoiler or something on the back of the car. I don't know. Maybe we'll have to find that jack wagon at some point. Every time. Like, every time. Now, before, he would just pass you with his thump thump music blaring. But now he actively tries to kill me. Oh, 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 beer in the middle of the roadway. Beer in the middle of the roadway. No one's under. Oh, come on, man. Come on, man. I just got... I wasn't wearing my safety harness. Wow, I can't believe I'm not dead. I worked so freaking hard to get this car in one piece. I put the new springs on, I tightened everything up to make sure that I wasn't losing fluids, and like, not even 10 minutes of gameplay goes by, and a fender ejaculates off the side of, it ejects off the side of the car. In a magnificent fashion. Now, screw screw this. I'm doing this repair right now. This is freaking BS. I'm not... I didn't go through all this work. Oh, there's my envelope. I didn't go through all this work for nothing. Give me a ratchet. Ratchet powers. Activate. Yes. Okay. Stop sliding, vehicle. You know, it's like... Sometimes I say to myself, I'm like, Oh, it's my own fault. I should have put the emergency brake on. The emergency brake doesn't do anything. I'll put the emergency brake on. The car will still slowly defy the will of Satan and move toward the middle of the roadway. That's what it is. I just saw it. It's my freaking beer cases. My beer cases are ruining people's lives. I'm going to leave them there. Don't you worry. I got the harness on this time. We're not we're not giving that a go again. Hold on. Where's the beer over here? Don't worry. I'll put the harness on, but I won't look at the road when I drive. That's how it goes, though. But yeah, we're, we're good on marks. We got the we got the suitcase full of millions again. I'll tell you too. The old girl here has plenty of power now. Plenty of speed and power. 13.1 is damn good. I'm actually really enjoying it. Now, I will say, I feel like having the two Oh, here he is. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, I couldn't see it. Ah! Crap. I couldn't see it. I was trying to see if I could uh if I could see if his vehicle changed at all. Like I said, with a lot of these updates, vehicles and stuff end up changing every once in a while, so I like to try and look around. Welcome to the beautiful town of Periarvi, where scumbags, boom, are always plentiful. Now I feel, now I feel like the thump thump car. When I come in hot like that, it's one of my favorites. All right, where the hell's the envelope at? Hopefully, oh, okay, good. I was gonna say, hopefully it's still here. A lot of times I end up flip-flopping all over the place so much that I, I lose it. Come here, baby. Come here. Oh, it's just like in real life. I don't know about you guys, but I lose stuff in the creases of my seats all the time. And like, I'll find it like two months later. I'll just forget that it was there. Now remember, don't lose your envelope through the earth. Because that sucks. All right, now let's make sure, absolutely sure that it goes in nice and smooth. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that worked. Might as well grab an extra case of beer while we're here. Hey, but you boys want to race? I got a brand new racing carburetor in this thing. You're going to love it. Come on, baby. What you say? What you say? Man, that face. Oh, God, that face. How about you, buddy? Usually when I get close enough, you get all annoyed. There it is. Yes. Come on. Drink up with me. Turn on the ignition and let's head on out of here. Uh. Hey, hey, you want my old carburetor? I don't need it no more now. Uh, how about that right there? Come on, Aren't you, don't you want to race, man? There we go. That's what I like to see. Yes, yes. Let us all go inside of our vehicles and and run around like jerk wagons until my freaking thing comes in. Will you? Okay, get out of the way. I have to get in my car. 
Jesus. Okay, all right, this is a little out of freaking hand here. Buddy, buddy, all right, let's work together on this. Let's work together. <laughs> oh, these freaking two. Oh, I've already flipped my car. I don't know how this happened. I legitimately already flipped my car. Like, I got it for 10 seconds. I went to go do something, and I ended up flipping the car. How did this happen? I didn't even do anything. Is it from the sheer power? Is it the sheer power of the racing carburetors? Look at that. First try, baby. Right over. I love it. As a matter of fact, in order to try and make days go by, we could also get into a fight with Status D, because that should have us wake up back at the house, but... Fatigue's pretty high. I think we're going to be fine. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What is this? What is this? Why are you on the wrong side of the road? Oh, God. He was overtaking the red car, and he almost flattened us. I told you. It's a survival game. Oh, there's a beer case. Got to watch out for those random beer cases. They will make you do flips like you don't even know. It's a survival game. It, it looks like a car game, but really what it's trying to do is make you, like, flip your computer out the window every 10 seconds. Someone sent me a Twitter... A little uh, Twitter video of them dying in permadeath, giving the middle finger to the screen over and over again, slapping the, the laptop down in frustration. I know your pain. That's why I don't do the permadeath anymore. I've got a good way to kill some time too. If we need more days to go by before the nitrous is in, I've got uh, like, I don't even know, I think like six or eight bottles, empty uh, juice frog bottles back in the house. We'll fill it up with kill you over and over and over again and get freaking pissed drunk repeatedly so that we fall asleep. And that should help us get some days to go by. Man, driving with slicks on these dirt roads in the front really brings back the fun of driving off road. I felt it wasn't challenging anymore. And now it's a lot like driving a John Deere tractor, but instead of like, you know, having wheels on the front, it has ice skates and you're driving it on ice quite fun actually I, I highly endorse this home sweet home oh yeah just peel right over here there we have it well I'd hang out shower with all my clothes on maybe curse incessantly to get some of the stress down clearly that's what this game is teaching me is that in order to get the stress down over in Finland you just sit in the shower for a few minutes cursing wildly to yourself and it seems to solve all the world's problems fresh sauna makes everything better Look at that stress meter fall. Oh yeah, wow. Actually, actually fell very quickly. Like I said, I just pretty much keep the sauna on at all times. A little bit of white noise helps me sleep and stuff. All right, so this is an early bedtime. About seven o'clock, we can throw on some topless gun, hit the hay, and then hopefully, there we go. Hopefully our items will be in soon. Oh, also, I was like, someone needs to make a topless gun YouTube streaming channel just streaming topless gun 24 hours a day. Someone did it. <laughs> you guys are terrible. Uh oh. Oh, he's back. Oh, per Kelly to you too, buddy. Um, all right. Well, we know how to handle this guy. We just got to put our dukes up and give him a quick jab, and he's out for the count. All right. So he's going to come in with a left over here. He's going to come in with it. There it is. There it is. Yeah. That's what's happening, boy. Get your ass out of my house. Get your ass out of my house. Well, a day has passed, but it's still not enough. Which means that it's freaking kill you time. So we're going to be drinking juice frog for a long, long time. That's one juice frog down. Oh, juice frog. Do you remember what you did to me on freaking YouTube? We're going to have to piss while we're drinking all this juice frog. Otherwise, we're going to die as our bladder explodes and kills us. So, always make sure while you're scarfing down freaking bottles of juice frog, pee everywhere and don't stop. Because if you do, it's going to be a bad freaking day. Should be the last one over here. I think one left. What do we get? Six of them? I think we got six of them. Is that... Did we get them all? There we go. One last one. I, the, I hope you can't eat just the raw yeast or whatever over there. You shouldn't be able to. All right. Now it is time. Since I can't sell these to kill you, man, anymore, it really... Oh, crap. There's really no reason to uh, to keep it. Plus, we're, we're filthy rich as well. I mean, it's not like we need the money or anything like that. So we are going to have to make another batch pretty soon, though. I'm running out over here. I'm just, they're, it's going pretty quick. Now, I think what I'm going to do... I think what we'll do is we'll hit some beers first because there's no reason not to. 
And then, when we're good and drunk, we'll start hitting all the kill you as hard as possible. So here we go. I know everyone always wants me to do this. They're like, great. Drink an entire case of beer. Well, this is an entire case of beer, but it is a case with beer in it. So we're going to do as much of it as we can and then hit the kill you up. Now, the good part is, is that our stress is way, way down because we have been drinking our worries away for at least a half case of beer, I would say. All right, the world is starting to get a little distorted. That's what I like to see. As a matter of fact, we have so many cases of beer. I should really do this at least once a day. That sounds terrible. But I should probably do this once a day to get time to go by faster. You can see our stream moving very lovely. All right, and now comes to kill you, boys. And this is where things start getting heavy. This is where things start getting heavy. There's one over there. Oh, oh. okay, it's going to get hard to grab to kill you. It, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. Come on. I need at least one more. I need at least one more. Don't you, don't you fall on me yet? Yes. There we go. Now we're getting it. Now we're getting it. Oh, the seasickness. Oh, the seasickness. Mother of God. No, no, no. Don't fall down yet. Don't fall down yet. Don't fall down yet, kid. You can do this, Rocky. Come on. Don't let anyone tell you what to do. Come on. You have to piss quick enough. You have to piss quick enough. I think, I think I've got all of the kill you. Nope. I sure didn't. There was at least one left. Quickly. Piss in time. Oh, the world's starting to go black. The world's going black and we are freaking out. We are out big time. Oh, we're still horribly drunk. It's still Thursday? You gotta be kidding me. The guy's still asleep, too. Can you hear? Oh. Oh, Satana. Oh, we're crawling. I can't even. Can I stand? Oh, you can. Okay, good. Oh, it's horrible. But don't worry, boys. There's a bottle of booze over here. We just need to grab it. <laughs> Oh, yes! <laughs> ah, yes! Oh, there we go. Oh, this is god-awful. Oh, if you think it's hard to watch, you should see what it's like to try and drive this guy. Oh, we're back to sleep again. Let me ask you boys something. Have you ever been so drunk that a full 24 hours later, you were still like this? That would, I, I don't know, man. I, I think this is, that would be as close to, that would be pretty close to death. Uh, because it has been at least, at somewhere around 24 hours. Now, I think we have another drink over here. Uh, there it is. There it is. Hold on. I can get it. I can get it. Oh, I just ate a sausage. There it is. Yes. Pop it open. We're not done yet, boys. We're not done yet. <laughs> And the world fades to black one more time. It is Saturday now. <laughs> That's two days. Okay. I think... I... Yeah, Satana can't help you, man. I think at this point we should be good. Oh, maybe a shower will help this. Oh, it's so horrible. We've got the shakes. We're still drunk. We're hungover. This was a bad idea. I should have just run in circles and slept. We just got the call. It's time to go pick up the nitrous. The only problem was I went to grab a beer and it turned out that there was a kill you bottle that was not empty. Uh, <laughs> it still had kill you in it. So I'm fairly drunk while we're gonna try and do this. But I think we're gonna be okay. As long as we've got our harness on, we're gonna be just fine. Also, I can't remember when this was changed, but it looks like waiting for the parts is also an in-game waiting time, not a, not like a game play waiting time. Meaning like if you sleep and you try and pass the days, it doesn't help. You have to be logged in, in the game, playing for it to count. And it takes about, I don't know, probably about like an hour or two at the very least. I'm not going to lie. It's a little bouncy now and again. Oh, God. Especially around these corners because I go to turn, but the drunkenness turns either too much or too little compared to what I want. And we're all over the road. This is what it would look like. Right by there. Oh, actually, from this position, it doesn't look that bad at all. It looks like we're driving just fine. This is not an accurate portrayal. Of course. Of course. Now it's raining as well. Why, why wouldn't it be? Why wouldn't it be raining? It makes perfect sense. Anything else? Anything else want to happen? You might as well have Trogdor come. Really? 
I was gonna say, we might as well have Trognar coming down the <laughs> as soon as I crash, the rain stops. What the hell, Finland? There he is! I told you it was all it was only a matter of freaking time. Something came off in our car, too. I don't know what it is. This oh! Oh, it's the exhaust! What the hell? How come I can't grab it? Oh, there we go. That's good. We don't need exhaust in the vehicle anyway. What I mean, what really what does exhaust do? That's that's that valuable. Just go ahead and throw that over there, it'll be fine. Oh good! He got what's coming to him. That's what you get, you dirty scumbag. You wanna freaking take my car out while I'm already kicked and down in the mud? I tell you, I love the smell of exhaust in the morning. Hopefully there's no police. If there's police out here, we're gonna have a real friggin' issue. Because uh, my drunkenness is not going to go down enough by the time I get to one of those checkpoints. And if I blow into that little meter, it is gonna read bad. Driving surprisingly well for being very, very, very drunk. I would say, I, I mean, oh well, all right, we're crossing the line a little bit now, but there we go. Yeah, looks fine. It's kind of like being in a boat, you know? Like we're hitting the waves right now, so the boat kind of banks to the right, then the boat banks to the left. Whoa, we need to get gas big time too. Like, big time. We should be fine. We'll be able to get to town easy and have enough time to get a little bit of fuel, but uh, the big thing is I just need to not forget to get it. Because half of the time, I'm like, oh, yeah, we're going to stop by town and get gas. And I never end up getting gas. I remember the beer. I remember the sausages. But I never remember the gas. Ah, oh, crap. No. 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 I haven't seen you guys in forever. And now I get this crap? You got to be freaking kidding me. What do you... Oh, man. We're going to get hit. We're gonna get hit with a vine. I know it. Oh, there's some pizza over here, though. Found my windshield. Hey! Found my windshield. Don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I sure as hell have it. Yeah, we are wobbling all over the place. If I get this ticket, I'm not paying it. I mean, maybe I'll pay it later, but our, our money's going toward the nitro. Yep, we're doing it. Go ahead. So, uh, what do you think, officer? No big deal, right? Just a couple of beers here and there. Damn it! Uh, our stress meter just went up the friggin' wazoo. So now I gotta hit the old cigarettes. I don't want to have to do this. But after that level of stress, I'm gonna burn this entire cigarette down in one puff. There we go. All the way down. What kind of lungs does this guy have? Oh, look at our buddy over here. What happened to him? <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. Got his old, got the car stuck on the side of a yeah, the side of that damn embankment. That's happened to me plenty of times. All right, now the stress is down. Now we're looking okay. Get rid of that. Uh, this is interesting. The items are outside without me having to pay. This is weird. I mean, I I eventually have to pay, right? Like, he has to make me pay. Uh... Oh, I think someone had, someone, there was some sort of problem with this where, like, it kept duplicating the parts. Maybe that's what's happening right now. I don't know. Let's see if we can install this thing. Also, how is it that my windshield followed us the entire way here without falling off of the car? I can't believe that that stayed on top of the freaking hood or the roof. All right, so the bottle holder goes back in here like so. There's some bolts in it, too. I'm pretty sure we have our tool kit. I know I threw it in here. Don't you lie to me. Yeah, I knew we had it. I don't know. Oh, it's because I... Whenever you wield the toolkit through the car, all hell breaks us. Oh, we're super thirsty. But I can't drink more beer and subject you guys to more drunkenness. That's got to be horrible to watch. So instead, let's get something nice and healthy. There we go. A bunch of milks will make a... Does a body good over here. There we are. Hope you don't mind if I open it up right out here, Tamo. Right over here. There we go. I don't know what size bolts these are, so I'm just going to try a three over here and see. Wow. First try. How do you like that? Now, I imagine this just slips right inside of the hole, like so. There we go. Um, I, I don't imagine you have to tighten anything down. I should probably double check just in case. How did this? Did I put this down? I feel like I, that, I don't think I put that down. All right. So now the injectors. Hold on now. The injectors should go right over here by the carb. Uh, 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 right there. Now, I think that there's some bolts on here as well. I just don't know what size they are. Oh, they're apparently they're this size. I think they're this size. Don't hit me. 
Please, God, don't hit me. Freaking, that bus is a killer, man. It comes out of nowhere. It'll take your ass out in a heartbeat. I've died so many times to it. Oh my God, what a pain in the ass. All right, let me show you this so that you don't have to go through the pain I went through. It is the very first, the very first socket, socket one. And you're looking for these two bolts right over here. I think that's the ones. Now I'm kind of getting lost. I'm pretty sure it's these ones though. You gotta tighten these ones down over here. Otherwise, I don't think this thing will work. Well, it may still not work. I'm not really 100% sure. But we have everything, I think, set up. You can do anything with the finish head, but including putting exhaust on when the car isn't even lifted. Now, finding the bolts, that's a little bit more of a pain in the ass. Of course, I've put on the damn thing enough at this point that I can almost basically see them from way downtown. Having trouble screwing your exhaust in? Just jump right inside of the engine bay. Everything will work out just fine. All right, it's mostly on. Now I think what we're looking for here, hold on now. I think what we're looking for here is a pressure of, I think it's like 1250 or so. Holy crap, I could just barely see this thing if I lean forward and zoom in. So I think we're trying to get right till about there. I think. Let's find out. Oh, here goes the pressure. Hopefully this thing doesn't blow the second I try and turn it on. All right, here we go. Here we are. All right. Now we must attach the button. Okay, so here's where I'm out of my element. Do you, damn it with the thirst, man. All right, I'll, I'll drink a beer. We're not, we're not freaking drunk anymore, so it should be okay. Here's where I'm out of my element. You turn the car on before you hit the friggin' button, right? I mean, that's what they did on the Fast and the Furious. This is what I have to go off of, you understand, okay? I, I'm guessing here. All right, found where the button goes. Right about there. All right. So, do you just press it? Yeah, I guess so. All right, hop on in here. Turn the car on. Turn the car on. Come on, baby. Here we go. All right, car's running. Door's closed. Harness is on. So now, hold on, let's get out in the road. Because Vin Diesel always did it like mid-stride. He would, what the hell just came off the car? How did my drive gear fall off? What the hell? I swear to God, I don't know where this came from. I don't know why this came off. Damn it. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I must have, I must have gotten a wrong screw somewhere or a wrong bolt somewhere when I was messing around putting the damn injectors in. It's the only reason. This is how it happens. This is how it happens. This is what I'm talking about. I it's I say it's the gremlins, but really it's just me. I mess around with this damn thing so much that I end up taking all kinds of bolts off that I probably need. Unfreaking believable. Unfreaking believable. I think there's like six freaking bolts in this thing too, or something. Okay, this should do it. All right. Looks like we're driving okay right now. Nothing's falling off. No drive gears. Freaking exploding into the middle of the road, so we should be just fine. Now, whereabouts do you hit this thing? I imagine you want to hit it early on, right? Here we go, we're moving along. Things are looking pretty good. And Vin Diesel, guide my nitrous. Yes, feel the power flow through you. The nitrotic power. I, I think it's on right now, right? Yeah, it's definitely on. It seems to be working. I feel a little bit of extra power and, and thrust here. We gained, we redlined pretty quick over here. Whoa, 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 okay, getting a little bit crazy. A little bit crazy. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Holy God, yep, it's working. Listen to, look at the needle. <laughs> look at that needle bounce, baby. Look at that needle bounce, that's what I'm talking about. Now what happens if you turn it off? Halfway through, there we go. It kind of evens itself out, all right. I, I think we have it working, I think. Like I said, I know just enough to figure out how to get it installed, which is a friggin' feat, because I had, there, there's, there, this is like trial and error to get this thing installed, but we made it happen. Guys, feel free to let me know what we can do to get our, can we turn it back on again? I guess you can. Feel free to let me know what we can do to make our nitrous even better and more powerful as time goes on. Leave your suggestions in the comment section below. Until next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.